Hey everyone, Mitchell Gould here, and in today's video, we're gonna be going over creating LinkedIn text ads. So I'll show you how they appear on LinkedIn, and then we'll go into the campaign manager, and we'll set them up. All right, so taking a look at how they show, they show on desktop. Um, they won't show on the audience network, they'll only show in LinkedIn on desktop. And they show on this right-hand side um, panel area. So sometimes they'll be um, lower on the panel, sometimes they'll be higher up on the panel, but you can see that it says promoted here, and then there's three text, ad, um, text ads right here. Uh, they consist of an image, a headline, and a description, and then you can have them linked to a, a specific URL, a specific page, or you can have them linked to your LinkedIn company page. These are some examples uh, from text ads that show in my feed. I just took a screenshot of them. Uh, you can see, yeah, there's a, a use of different images here. Upwork is pretty consistent with theirs, um, just using their logo. Uh, Client Boost here, they're using uh, a small image here and then using their logo here. So again, there's a variety of ways of how you can go about it using numbers in the headline um, to make it a little more catchier. And I'll go through some other examples when we go through the campaign build. But uh, yeah, just wanted to show you a few different examples of those. And in terms of the objectives that you can use when uh, with the text ad format, you can use the brand awareness objective, website visits, or the website conversions. So depending if you're doing retargeting or cold prospecting, um, there's a few options on the objectives you can use. In today's video, we'll be using the website visits objective and uh, we'll go ahead and jump into that now. So I have the campaign manager pulled up. Um, I'm in the advertise section here and I'll go ahead and go into a existing campaign group. If you don't have a campaign group, you just create that there. And then once I'm in the, the campaign group, I'm gonna go to create, create campaign, click next. I'm not gonna go through the taxonomy of how I normally name my campaigns. I'll do that in a future video. But for this video, I mainly wanna show you how you create the text ad. Um, so we'll go ahead and click website visits and um, this is where you would set up you know, your audience and we'll go to the ad format and we'll click text and then we'll have our budget there and then we'll go into um, actually creating the ad. So we'll save that. As you can see, it's pretty straightforward. We just have to add an image, uh, a 100 by 100 pixel square image, that's two megabytes or smaller and then a headline that's within 25 characters and a description within 75 characters. And then we could add our URL. This is just in a test account. So you will see the option if you have your company page linked up to also advertise to your, your company page or your career page on LinkedIn. But in this example, it's just showing the URL. So we'll go into this uh, document I have here. This is just a, a simple Google Sheet to draft out some text ad, ad ideas. And this is just for like a fictitious HR company. So I added the content in here from uh, this Google Sheet for this text ad. And uh, I added the URL. I included the UTM source, medium, and UTM uh, campaign. Those are always helpful to use if you're passing additional data into your CRM. We'll go over a more in-depth video on UTM tracking, but just wanted to point that out there. Added a image, so you can see the example of how the ad will show. Uh, pretty straightforward. Then you can just click save. And then if you click next, you can go into publishing your campaign live. It's always good to add in multiple variations of different ads. So what you can do is just click duplicate and it'll duplicate your ad and then you can adjust the headline and description and even the URL. Oh, it looks like our company page is showing here now. So you could click company page um, or go to the careers on LinkedIn portion as well. So that's an option. So just as an example, I updated this copy and then I'll, I'll save the ad. And then you'll see we have another version of the ad there. So yeah, sometimes I like to add in different emojis to help the, uh, the ad pop a little more. So that's always an option. Um, 
You can use ChatGPT to help you with emojis and to help you with your headlines and descriptions and create different variants. But yeah, that's pretty much it. It's pretty straightforward to get a LinkedIn text ad campaign going. Um, in the future, I'll share more data on the performance of some of these campaigns. But yeah, if you have any questions on that, please put them in the comments section and I'd be happy to answer them and help you out with anything there. So thanks for watching and have a great day.